This nigga CP look like the lost member of B2K right now. Wow. <laughs> you know what's That's funny? funny? This nigga sharp, though. funny here to hear if you could take a fucking roast. You want me to start going on this bitch? I came on here with 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 the do-rag going. The, the, the decision was already made. Come on, here's, this bitch with the do-rag going. That's it. Here's what's classic, bro. The As CP knows, my favorite shit is watching this nigga's offended face. <laughs> that nigga was not planning on no smoke. <laughs> this nigga hit him with a joke, bro. Who's CP's offended face? First of all, first of all, oh. what's up, Lulu? What's up, Farron? Right, <laughs> How are y'all doing? You guys look amazing. Don't oh, don't crazy. listen to Thank here. You. Yeah, to hear. And you Chris, though. I said you Chris with it. Yeah, bro. You look like you in the Krispy Kreme corporate offices right now. You <laughs> <laughs> oh, here talking about ice and them feelings. I had to take this meeting real quick because we got a whole new hot press system going on. <laughs> we got the we got the U bakes coming out now. When the U bakes drop. Bay, you, you make it home. hard to defend you when you do things like this. You you it, right? Well, listen, we 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 got it coming directly to your phone now. You get the <laughs> you get the hot symbol going straight yeah, to your phone. Yeah, yeah, nigga, they put they finna put the here on all the cups. Yeah, you think you went to a chocolate milk? You gonna never have to here on the cups. Well, you take your charm or your chain and just spin it around real quick like us. Oh. <laughs> Here's the problem, bro. Where did it? We all know where this came from. To hear started this entire thing, bro. CB was on some cool shit. Yeah. And now yeah. he's in the headquarters for Krispy Kreme. This nigga, this nigga to hear was on the retreat with the with the with the with the rooster from the Chick-fil-A box and Wendy. And they all came together and was like, look, we need to figure out a way to not only supersize our cup size, you understand me? But do the monopoly on the side of the cup. Boop, peel the cup down. You know what I'm saying? We not finna go out like Hamburglar. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> so. How did it go out, bro? <sighs> oh, you know how Hamburglar went out? <laughs> on some charges. They got Hamburglar on a Rico charge. <laughs> they got Hamburglar on a Rico charge for the special sauce. He was slinging the special sauce. That's how Arby's been staying in business. They've been they've been cutting their mayo with special sauce. To hear cracked the whole case. To hear was the Arby's. I like, wait a goddamn minute. Wait a minute. That's what I do. Is this Big Mac sauce on a uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. a Rico charge? Jeez, right. Louise. Wow. CP just comes in so aggressive, man. I don't know what got him. No, <laughs> you started uh -uh. all of it. You started this. Man. You will not play innocent. <laughs> I came in, I greeted everybody. I thanked everybody for being here. CP just came in swinging. Came I don't in know here with the came fucking with. solid gold by Cuspit talking <laughs> shit <laughs> to people. <laughs> he came in here like, like he's selling watches on his inner uh, on his inner lining. What you need? Now li listen, listen, when, when I tell you this, <laughs> as a go to fear, I'm gonna be here for the next three days. As a uh, GTT. They call me GTT. <laughs> GTT. So you gotta put that on a t-shirt, yo. Just happened. What <laughs> just happened? I did not come here for this. This is ridiculous. This is this is how my friends treat you, man. I don't know why. Uh, see, that different. is gaslighting. <laughs> what we was talking about earlier, you were like, "What's the definition of gaslighting?" What you are doing right now to CP is gaslighting. I just said, "Hello, CP. I like what you're doing with the look, man." <laughs> It's a very nice he, he dude. Do do so I don't know what the I hell it is. To you to hear. I said nothing. I didn't say it to hear what this bitch with the music soul child starter kid on right now. With the boom, 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 this might seem strange. Yeah. Uh huh. I did that song knowing yeah, I couldn't anyway. sing at anyway. one of my college performances. It was like, how many times did you perform in your college? Because I've seen several yeah. videos of said performances, bro. I was in a lot of groups, man. And what Neo Soul University did you go to? You did all of this shit. <laughs> I, I was did trying to get I was trying to get scholarships from every group that I could. So I was in a lot of groups. Like, I, did you I, change I, the song or did you do I, the original? Did you do I did your the own original. rendition? I did the original rendition. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Grab me a water. Hold on, y'all. <laughs> Man, that nigga bro. slid on across the floor to get that water, though. I guarantee you.
Never mind. I don't need the water anymore. Damn. To hear? <laughs> Dumb bro. You see, look at CB's face. That this nigga is stepped this up to the streets to go get that water. <laughs> Like that. You don't know how nah, CP, wait, wait. When CP turn off his camera, that's when you know. <laughs> he turn off the whole camera and just go away for a little bit. Because this is science. Funny. This nigga be offended yeah. and catch everybody by surprise because this nigga really be on some cool shit. <laughs> that's the first the time I ever seen CP came in cool, calm, and collected. He ain't say oh, nothing. He ain't say no right. roast. He came I've been and sick. Down. I had COVID. Now I'm feeling right. better. I'm blessed to be alive. I'm, I'm starting to appreciate <sighs> life more. Here come to here. <laughs> first of all, first of all, where did you find a gold tooth to go over baby teeth? For I didn't think they made them <laughs> for kindergarten teeth. Nigga, where did you get a grill it's, for kindergarten teeth? It's really a Lego. I, was, <laughs> yeah, I bet. Nigga, they got that bitch from the Halloween store. Did y'all got the oh children's grill? God. Where the children's grills at? Where are the children's grills? It's a, it's a limited edition pants. Yeah, he is Bob Grill. ACP, that ain't nothing but aluminum foil. He just took the aluminum foil and put it on the side. Lulu, and you set your sweaty, yeah. hug giving ass up, okay? <laughs> it was the last episode. Now, Lulu said she was in the, in the gym giving out sweaty hugs. <laughs> I did, but I took a shower today, nigga. Today? <laughs> <laughs> I've been hanging out with Ashton Kutcher and them. You know, you know, you only take showers every so often. You don't no. need to do it every day. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> What's up with that? White folks don't wash up, huh? They say they only hit the hot spots. That's disgusting. How come, how come it ain't never no niggas wash in the soap hair and just let the soap run down? Nigga, we are keeping Dove afloat, but you think they put us in their soap commercials? No. Nuh-uh. It be, it, be, it, be, it be these once a weekers. That that dial, that yellow dial, so oh, you go to oh, anybody. Yeah. Why are you using, you using that? that? No, 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 not now, but back in the day, shit, that was that was your yeah. home. Yeah, you go to anybody's grandma house, you'll find that, that yellow dial, that oh, bar yeah. of yellow dial, the liquid gold. Mm -hmm. That I like the color, so I would go over to my hood cousins' houses and be like, oh man, I like the color of the soap, but it wasn't doing shit for nobody. I used to be in the shower staring at it, thinking about Jurassic Park when that mosquito was in that little thing. <laughs> Like Amber? Yeah, like, look at this. Look at this. Mm, they're magical. Mm. <sighs> Yo, this is that's what I was just watching. I feel that like too. That's why he is so happy to be out of quarantine and feeling better. Oh this man, I have no idea, man. <laughs> it, it was just irritating. It wasn't even like it wasn't even it wasn't even horrible. Like I, I feel like I've been sicker than that, just having a cold. Mm. But it was like, nigga, you think you ain't finna have the runs today? You know, oh, for real? You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, what? <laughs> nah, see, you, you sounded like Paul, shit on the, the phone. movie. You said what? You, you sounded like shit on the phone. Like, you oh, sounded bad. You, sounded bad. you had a little cough. CP, he was with, listen, CP was, was so tired of being stuck in that room. He would do any, I called this nigga five minutes before I had to turn in the audition to read with me. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I wish the nigga was a little readier. I don't know what you be going through, man. But I'm like, oh, this nigga don't know these lines like a mother. This nigga is, is stumbling over the. I, I have COVID, nigga, and I'm prepared. <laughs> I, I have the heart back on pat. I nigga, wish you like, were action. readier. <laughs> nigga, action. Well, y'all did a Zoom audition? <laughs> yeah, I, just, I needed to read with somebody. So I, when I have that and Ferris out there, I'll Zoom one of the homies and just have him read with me while filming on my phone. <laughs> Gotta do it, man. That well, I know I mean, you gotta do it. I just picture him being all COVID ready, and you ain't no shit. Like, oh, uh, well, no, I mean, I had to get into my actor role, I had to do my warm ups, yellow leather, red leather. Nope, nope. <laughs> the tongue twisters just to get the words out. Don't correctly. do that in public, that, that it's never goes well. Damn, real lot, baby. You can talk, you, you gotta crawl for you walk. This nigga walk up in McDonald's, like, yeah, I know what I want, shall we? <laughs> Y'all know what I want, shout it. Come on, so y'all know what I want, shout it. Man, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I know what I want, shout it. Come on, get the club away, shout it. They be like, they be like, look, they be like, we'll give it to you for free if you can say it. Mm. <laughs> Just bring out the money. Fish fish, come on, shout it, fish filet. Right. Fish filet, shout it. <laughs> come on, shout it. I'm like, right? fish filet. <laughs> you can't say fish filet? 
I can say it. I can say, say it. Say it. Fast. Okay. Say it. Fish fillet. You just okay. gonna stop at the one? Why? Well, I just used three times fast. Though. Watch this though. Watch this though. To hear say tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. What? what? <laughs> tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. Oh my god. Y'all ain't got tartar sauce in Detroit, niggas. Shut up. Tartar sauce. Tartar. Okay. Hey, we're not gonna have. A- Y'all ain't got, y'all ain't got we, sauce. We got all the condiments, nigga. Don't don't and, say like we ain't got shit now. And the only reason y'all got good water is because it comes from Canada. Y'all y'all know Detroit ain't got no good water. Y'all good water comes from Canada. That's what's saving a lot of y'all lives out there. Y'all don't even sell soap in St. Louis, from what I heard. <laughs> y'all have to import. Y'all gotta import your hygiene from other states, nigga. No that's way. Why, that's why really? a lot of y'all. That's why a lot of y'all develop freckles. It's from the lack wait, of soap. Wait, connect that. <laughs> connect that for me. It's the, the lack, lack of soap, soap and the lack of hygiene. The lack of soap, okay? The influx of bees. I don't know if you ever seen my girl, but <laughs> the bees get a hold of the musty ass kids. Bink, 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 bink. And guess what happens? The whole uh, neighborhood children smell like the change machine at the arcade. Mm. So you trying and to say bees. freckles is dirt residue? No, that's left the, over? The, the freckles are small honeybee nests. <laughs> CP, shut How up. How did we get shut here? Up. All right. All right. Shut, shut up talking to me. You're right. You're right. Fan, right. you you engaged with this. This was this was this. No, was, I ain't gonna lie. There. Freckles, freckles come from drinking too much Pepsi. You, you could tell because your damn uh your face look um uh carbonated. <laughs> you think like I baby had bubbles? Ah Lulu, don't help. Don't help, I, Lulu. It's like baby bubbles. When like the nigga this. put his glasses on, it, it, it sound like a fresh Pepsi. Like, baby you ready to go? <laughs> <laughs> Lulu, it's like up. Rice Krispies. You listen to his face and start talking a little bit. You ready to go? Lulu, <laughs> snap, snap, Lulu, put on, pop. Lulu put on lingerie just to clean her AR-15. That's the only <laughs> I do. Why not? Why you saying like that? That's how I kind of fly. That's how I kind of fly. I can't hold <laughs> you up. Can't hold you up. Lulu, Lulu you can't bite a nugget, it sounds like he moving the couch. Like bite around on that side. Bite that other side for me real quick. Bite the other side for me, please. Get, lift the other side up, please. I can't bite the whole nugget through. Bite, hold the other side up, parent. Hold the other side up. Oh, this, this is the me nugget, the please. nugget? <laughs> you eat a nugget, it sounds like you moving the couch. Hold the other side. Get the other side for me real quick. <laughs> if you lift, then I can bite. If you lift, I'm about this girl, if you lift, I can bite. <laughs> Here's the problem, bro. The problem is, yo, <laughs> this is what happens when he gets offended. Like, this nigga's not gonna get off you, bro. He's not going to get off of you. Yes, I love it. It's gonna make for a great episode. <laughs> this is the perfect time for us to jump into today's topic, and we're gonna do that right after we introduce the guest. We got the hilarious <laughs> CT. You son of a bitch. We got. The adorable, Damn, hilarious, fantastic Farron Moore. And we got I the think guns still do better. beautiful bombshell Lulu Gonzalez in the squad as well. Original squad, we got CP in the house and up to here more. We're going to jump into this first topic right after this. When you run a business, time seems more precious. Every misplaced moment feels like a missed opportunity, a lost chance to make your business better, or even just step away and recharge. ShipStation gives e-commerce sellers like you more time to do what you really love. Unless what you really love is managing every single little detail of order fulfillment. (laughs) ShipStation automates time intensive shipping processes so you can get back to focusing on the bigger things like developing new products, honing your marketing strategy, or interacting with your customers. No wonder ShipStation is already trusted by over 100,000 sellers. What I would do with all that free time is take a little bit of time of relaxation, take a little bit of break or something. Would you miss doing all those things, hmm? Would you miss doing all those shipping tasks manually? Didn't think so. ShipStation has saved me so much time and I need time because it's so precious to me. All those manual shipping tasks was eating up my time. ShipStation is really good at those. So let ShipStation handle all of your shipping and handling and get back to what you're good at, growing your business. It works for all your storefronts too, Amazon, eBay, Etsy, and more. And it lets you automate all the manual work that goes into shipping. 
you will also get deeply discounted shipping rates normally reserved for Fortune 500 companies. And you can easily compare carriers, rates, and delivery time. So it's easy to choose the best option for every shipping scenario. In fact, 98% of companies that use ShipStation for a year keep using it for as long as they're in business. So it's time to let go of all those shipping tasks. ShipStation can do it better and faster. Sign up using the promo code SQUAD, S-Q-U-A-D-D, for a free 60-day trial at ShipStation.com and start saving time with every shipment. That's two whole months of shipping made quick and painless, and it's free to try. Just go to ShipStation.com, click on the little microphone at the top of the page, and type in SQUAD, S-Q-U-A-D-D. ShipStation, make ship happen. First topic of the day. When it comes to nasty time, lights on versus lights off. Here's the thing. How does it go? Do we each go or is it like a free-for-all It's thing? a free-for-all. You, you, you can say, okay. here's the thing. You can say, what's the thing, man? Okay. Don't, don't, here's don't, the, what's thing. the thing. If somebody, first of all, if you have a sex with somebody and they turn the lights out first, that needs to let you know where you are visually to them. That's number one. <laughs> if they turn... <laughs> If they turn them on you, nigga, you are not doing something right. I prefer the lights on because I like to see everything going on and I like to give her her credit for being amazingly beautiful. Mm. Amazingly beautiful. Yeah, right. yeah. Mm. No mud ducks. <laughs> but wait, does her looks change because the lights off? Well, here's the thing. Well, the lights off on you got started. The lights off, like, mind you, they're not bright. You know what I'm saying? I got the dimmer in there, you feel me? But I'm not about to be in there with pitch blackness. I want to see the ass move just as well as feel it. I want to see them titties shaking. I want to see the skin. I like I like the visual of it. Like, yeah. if you just in the dark, you just feel it. Sometimes I like to imagine I'm Ray Charles, and I got to find it without seeing. <laughs> <laughs> and I just, I just be in that motherfucker like, uh, the hummingbird, B, I'm going to tell you. Like for me, I don't mind either way, but you know, coming up, you know, having sex early, you know, your you early twenties and, you know, late teens and college and all that, you know, girls just be like, just do that, uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> just, just little, if we could just, and, quick, you know what I'm saying? And I feel the like when them lights went off, that's when they turned to their monster. Yeah, nigga, it's dark now, bitch. And so I've <laughs> yeah. gotten used to getting good coochie in the dark, you understand me? It's, but yeah, I, 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 I don't give a fuck, you know, because it's 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 so many. It's like a fucking fidget spinner when you really get going. There's so many senses you could stuff is jiggling and it's, <laughs> it's a fidget spinner. That was a great I reference. You know, what I'm saying? it's hella that senses. Was perfect. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what about you? I Luke? used to I used to be a fan of lights off. Before I grew up, and then I realized that that was real childish of me. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> I was, because it, I felt like I was doing something wrong, which I mm. was doing something wrong. But once I was grown, I was like, "Oh, this is this is perfect. This is exactly where I'm supposed to be in life." Where you're supposed to be. So. <laughs> right, it's on be. in the daytime. But here's yeah, the thing, yeah. though. If you got the light, I remember a, a young lady. <laughs> You know, she was giving me the opportunity to get it in. And she was like, turn the lights out. I was like, bitch, am I ugly? Is that what the fuck? What, what, is, what are we turning lights out? That's not what it means. The light can be distracting that sometimes. At that, as soon as I asked her that, she was like, I mean, you know, we both know what this is. And I was like, oh, shit. I am unattractive to her, but she can give me that That doesn't mean that either. It can I'm telling that. you, she told me this business. You're asking questions right there. I be asking shit, nigga. I be, yeah. asking, yeah. nigga. I be, I be, nigga. Which one? The lights up? Who put the strobe light? Until See, after. See for me, <laughs> you mean it's like if I, if I'm, you could be fine. I've had sex with a lot of fine ass dudes in the dark, but for me, it's just like I don't want to have an emotional connection with you, looking in your eyes, and you, you get like all of that extra mm. shit. Like that's for me. If I'm having the lights on, fucking you, I like you, and I want to connect with you. But if the lights is off, you could be fine as hell in the dark and i'm cool with that i just don't want you to connect with me like that yeah, looking all you. in your eyes all deep and stuff yeah and they want to do all extra shit and like get my face get 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 get, get move 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 <laughs> that's what she means like you know what this is this is just sex like i'm not trying to connect with you i don't want to bond with you oh. i don't want to that's what she's like you know what this is it's not that you ugly because if you was ugly she wouldn't fuck you hey but see she's she not trying to draws up with home like fuck you bitch <laughs> I, I don't need this shit <laughs> i am yeah. somebody but no i'm gonna say this though 
the joke be on y'all because my eyes is big as fuck and I can see in the dark. So I'd be like, yeah, get the lights on. <laughs> That's not what it means to have big eyes. But I also like it. I don't like it dark, dark. I like it like that. Fucking with infrared eyes. Yeah, I be fucking a bitch like Predator. Like this nigga's eyes turned into night vision goggles. <laughs> that nigga does this and goes to night vision. You got MVGs on on your eyes. That's you have crazy. reptilian man. <laughs> Hey man, God gave me these. Man, I can't take credit for something God did, but hey, God wanted me to see what the fuck going on. I be like, man, please, all I need is a little bit of moonlight, and I am in there <laughs> like swimwear. You imagine God putting CP together, but I like, get to the eyes like a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Little now he forgot. He walked away. You, like, can I tell you? You know when you, <laughs> you know when you leave eggs on the stove too long, You're like oh shit, I've got the motherfuckers. That's what happened with that. I like to I like to imagine that 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 guy was training somebody when he made me like an intern and he's like I know not can I put that whoa not that my god it's okay it's your first day and then he, <laughs> he, he looked at one of his homeboys like oh, it's okay it's all right it's all right you just your first <laughs> it's, it's okay it's all right I know don't us don't cry try don't cry I was, I was a baby like. <laughs> They just uh, come uh, to wait. the house once a week and make me blink. <laughs> I also don't like it. I don't like it pitch black. I like I like the moonlight. I like being able to see silhouettes. Mm. Like I can see your silhouette. I don't gotta be yeah. like dark, dark, like just to you know, see the body so I can see yeah. your outline. I don't know. <clears throat> light is distracting from here. So I'll be like, oh, what's that on the ceiling? Like <laughs> just, <laughs> there, there yeah, a gold goldfish she's, sometimes. She's a like, goldfish. Literally mid stroke. She'd be like, I gotta get those cobwebs. Shut the fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> Shut up. Turn over. That's another thing. That's another thing. That's why I like the dark because you can focus just on like what this, you're doing. When the lights is on, I'm like, damn, I clothes. left that towel over there. Hope you don't see them clothes over there. Like, you know, it'd be like a whole bunch of extra little shit I'm thinking about. Like, I'm gonna tell you right man. now, we seen them got their clothes before we <laughs> got in that box. <laughs> but let you go there right now. But if it was I'm dark, you wouldn't have seen shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so there's levels to it. It don't got nothing to do with your looks. If you also, made it past to let me get hit you it with into this. me. You was not ugly like that. I like, like that you got the levels up. <laughs> I like have that. seen girls where, uh, like in my past, when I would go over a girl's house, I went to this one girl's crib and she had roaches. So I did not want to be in the dark while we was getting it in because I needed to look around and make sure I wasn't taking nothing to the crib with me. You understand? Y'all all would be getting it in at the same exactly. time. Exactly. Hey, what have been the roaches? Like, Nigga, we leave. anybody fucking with y'all? Cut the goddamn <laughs> hey, Come on, man. Man, I had my shit, my arm one time. One time, I didn't even pull my pants all the way down. I pulled my, I pulled, <laughs> I pulled the, <laughs> I pulled the, the up from the bottom, and I pulled them down to where they were both meeting my kneecaps, so I could hold everything, so I make sure nothing crawled on me, bro. Mm -mm. Now I'll tell the truth, CT. You were sitting there with nothing but the zipper open, pants still up, no. buckle, belt still buckle. <laughs> You know why I wouldn't just do zipper? Because that residue, especially if you got on some jeans, the, the, the jeans? juices get on your jeans. And now after you leave, everybody know what just happened. So I Not couldn't do that, it. But that zipper, that zipper, those teeth grinding up uh, the, the shaft the bottom. Oh, no, no. Uh, hey, and one time in high school, I was fucking with this girl I had no business fucking with. And um, nigga, a fucking spring from her bed stabbed me in the ass. <laughs> A what? And I knew. A what? A spring from her bed stabbed me in one of my what? ass cheeks. And I knew for a fact. I'm like, oh, I got AIDS. I shouldn't even be fucking over here. I shouldn't even be you, here. Else. And I have AIDS now. Fucking with this bitch. <laughs> I have AIDS now. With a spring? Yeah. That's an old ass bed. Like I'm like, what you doing in that goddamn tub? I'm like, ah. <laughs> ah. Oh my God. Why are you in my tub? Ah! <laughs> Ask your mama to put a Band-Aid on your ass. <laughs> you gotta get a what happened? That. Tell me what happened. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh. Oh my God. 
Is he frozen or does he do that yeah, on purpose? He's no, he's frozen. Him and CT frozen. CT, yeah. I don't know what happened. <laughs> Somebody screenshot that. That's funny. <laughs> Damn, I missed it. I'll get it back and play back. <laughs> that got to be a thumbnail or something. CP what still, happened? bro. Still, and I hate see me was doing that shit on purpose. No, no, C, C, they both were frozen. CT still frozen. Yeah, I was frozen. CT, look at CT having a good ass time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> he looking like it, it's the seventies. <laughs> <laughs> it was the seventies. We had a good like, ass time, man. A good <laughs> laugh down in Terry's basement. <laughs> like somebody just asked about what happened to Barbara. Barbara? Oh, <laughs> y'all didn't hear about Barbara? Oh. oh man. Oh, <laughs> anyway. Woo! I mean, said, Tell me what happened. <laughs> <laughs> so so my real question is, so does the question pertain like in general or like do I like this person? Just like, in general. Oh, like what type of person are you? Lights on, lights off person. I'm gonna be childish. I'm gonna go lights off because I haven't found somebody that I want to look me in my eyes yet. So I'm gonna Ooh. go lights off. Who hurt you, Lulu? It's the life. Life, God. CT. Damn. She got DTSD. Girl, put a mirror, <laughs> bring a mirror in the room and look at yourself <laughs> saying shit. <laughs> I do that all the time, girl. What you talking about? Lulu got DTSD. Keep them lights man. Off. What happened? Be like, oh, this how I look when I get it. All right. I, I, I look, I've done it in the, with the lights on a lot of times, all the time. Barrett, oh. is that your impersonation of how you think she takes this? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not showing this woman so much, though. I like the fact that Farron pictured you having a good ass time. Like, all right. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> Oh, oh shit! Oh, this is too man. much for one p.m. on a Monday afternoon. <laughs> I did not expect this. Let's put it to a vote then. Lights on or lights off? I'm gonna go off. Okay. On. Nigga, you got a Batman towel. Oh, nigga, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, no you was born in the dark. Nigga, your head is uh. off, nigga. Goddamn lights turn, in Gotham. He turned the lights <laughs> off and then he go in the room and <laughs> turn on Hit the, the bat signal. Switch. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> the 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 that's how she knows time. Right, that's the light he really talking about when he wants the light on. And <laughs> Dream be like, "What's going on? You know what's going? You became the light on the dark side of me." <laughs> Why does the thing have so many songs ready, bro? That's the Batman he, song. I see you. <laughs> the light on the dark side of me. That's my song, see me? I've never known a single word to that song. That's my shit. That's yeah, man, me and his homeless man sang that shit in downtown Detroit one time. <laughs> we sang that shit. Oh, yeah. We was down in front of the Renaissance Center. We had it on video. We was sing we were singing our ass. So he was in a wheelchair. He was circling me. <laughs> Bro, let me that say you something. Like a serenade, my nigga. I was gonna say, um, he was dancing with you. <laughs> Yo, this nigga CP's song library is so always readily. <laughs> Available, bro. You have a hella song. You know that because of Reggie Bo. You know, I always got a song. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Baron, what you going with? Who did you say? Baron, what you going with? Oh, I answered. Lights on. Okay. CP. Yeah. Uh I'm gonna go lights off, man. Like uh you know, I think um, whatever's gonna make her more comfortable, we savages anyway, so it really don't matter. But mm -hmm. the more comfortable she is, the more uh, fun and better it's gonna be for me. So it's like, nigga, shit, lights off, let's get it. I don't care. Right. Damn. And yeah, I got a crazy imagination too. I'm fucking around. You an alien by the time I get done. <laughs> <fucking. laughs> Them big ass mean? eyes got you looking at another universe. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm going lights on. Look like the lights on happen <laughs> for that one. We're gonna jump into this next topic right after this. Why be content with having enough when you can have more? 
best fiends always satisfy your need for more. More puzzles, more me time, more fun. I love Best Fiends, and right now I am on level 1260. I love that I can just have some free time and play and kind of cut my brain off. I love playing with friends and family. It's, it's, it's so competitive and it's so fun to do. You gotta get Best Fiends, I'm telling you. It's a great game, one of the best puzzle games out there. It passes some great time when you need some free time to just shut your brain off from the world. What's great is, once you download Best Fiends, you can play anywhere, and I mean anywhere, even without internet connection, which is great if you're somewhere stuck without Wi-Fi, you know, you're somewhere camping and you can't get to the Wi-Fi, you can still play Best Fiends. Collect tons of fiends that get powered up as you play with more levels. Every win brings new challenges, thousands of puzzles to play. New in-game events are added all the time. I just got done playing a new event recently. With thousands of levels, there's always more to play. So go ahead and let enough is never enough be your mantra. Download Best Fiends for free from the App Store or Google Play. Plus, earn even more with $5 worth of in-game rewards when you reach level 5. That's friends without the R. Best Fiends. It's time to dig yourself out of that winter hibernation, fellas. Spring is here. And it's time to get sprung with a Blue Chew. That's right, this episode is sponsored by Blue Chew. Fellas, confidence can take you far in life. It can also help you in the bedroom, especially when it comes time to step up to the plate, if you know what I mean. That's where Blue Chew comes in. Blue Chew is a unique online service that delivers the same active ingredients as Viagra and Cialis, but and chewable tablets, and at a fraction of the cost. You can take them anytime, day or night, so you can plan ahead or be ready whenever the opportunity <laughs> arises. The process is simple. Sign up at bluechew.com, consult with one of their licensed medical providers, and once you're approved, you'll receive prescriptions within days. The best part, it's all done online, so no visits to the doctor's office, no awkward conversations, and no waiting in line at the pharmacy. That's the best part. Blue Chew tablets are made in the USA and prepared and shipped direct to your door in a very discreet package. It's time to get up the couch, fellas, and back to work. If your tool needs an upgrade, head to bluechew.com. So if you can benefit from extra confidence when it's time to perform, Blue Chew can help. And we've got a special deal for our listeners. Try Blue Chew for free when you use our promo code SQUAD at checkout. Just pay $5 for shipping. That's right. That's BlueChew.com with the promo code SQUAD, S-Q-U-A-D-D, to receive your first month free. Visit BlueChew.com for more details and important safety information. And we thank Blue Chew for being our sponsor of our podcast. Next topic oh, of the day. Jesus. Would you rather have chillings with every meal oh. versus ranch flavored soda with every meal? Ugh. I feel it's a food question every week. Ugh. People like food questions, yo. <clears throat> it always it started, it started like that. It started, we always had three questions and one of them was always a food question. Chitlins or a ranch soda? Ugh. Yeah. They sell it at Rocket Fizz. The store, the little, little, you know, like pop pop culture store. Oh, oh that's a real thing. Had it before? That's a real thing. Oh, they got, they got a before? ranch flavor. They got a bacon flavor. They have like a sour cream and onion. They got a all of these good ass flavors. Flavor or something. But Buffalo. have you tried them before? I haven't. Farron has. Farron's tried the uh, flaming hot Cheeto Mountain Dew. I can see what that. What was that? That's not the same. That's just a regular Mountain Dew, though. <laughs> a flaming hot Cheeto. I'm saying, like, that's a Mountain Dew flavor, and I've seen that. That I was Mountain Dew Red. Ranch. I ain't know, but Mountain oh, Dew Red. Mountain Dew Red. It had Mountain the flaming Hot logo on it. Yeah. yeah, they just had a lot of extra in the warehouse, and they repackaged the logo and gave y'all the same shit. That's believable. That's believable. I, I, I didn't try. Don't say that. They got to have a I little never kick. had the, what is it, Code Red before, so you might you could be right. But I will take chitlins with every meal. <clears throat> because fucking ranch fucking soda sounds so disgusting. Oh, really? At least I've tasted 
shitless. I've never even had ranch. I don't like the consistency. I don't like eating white creams. I am a fan of a chitterling that my mama prepares. Maybe that smell is atrocious, but I'll Let take me tell that. Tell you this: the best chitlins ever, some Chef Ramsay chitlins. I would take that because at the end of the day, I'm gonna start learning how to doctor them bitches up. But you can't fuck with my drink. If I can't wash nothing down, then mm-hmm. I'm throwing something up. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's true. Like, can I just walk off the edge of the earth? I don't want any of that. Ugh. Was that an option? Yeah. Yeah, I don't uh-huh. want none of that either. No. Here's the thing, chitlins aren't bad. It's like if, if you just close your nose and you just bite you like, oh, this is pretty good. If they're close prepared. Close your nose, right. close your eyes, and use somebody else's tongue. <laughs> if you eat ass, you can eat a chitlin. <laughs> that's a fact. That's that's Seven, a fact. Eight, but my thing is actually <laughs> if you eat chitlins, you can eat an ass. And I'm gonna tell you, <laughs> that's a pig's ass. Granted, it is stewed in juices and it is clean thoroughly, but still ass. I've never had chitlins. I've never ate ass. My thing is, like, most people... You never ate no ass, Lulu? I like my ass ate. I don't do the eating. That's different. That's too much. I can't see me having my man bend over and lift up his legs. And First of all, there it. are other ways for it to happen. Yeah, no, Either nigga, way. Anyway. Anyway. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. What Did you see how quick late WCT corrected you? Wait, wait, wait. First of all. There are so many other ways that you could do that. Listen, man, I'll take you back to 2011. There was a young lady. Uh, no, 2009. There's 2009. There's a young lady in the Bay Area that that showed your boy a good time. And she she went and grabbed my leg and said, hey, I'm not that guy. And then she found another way. And I was like, oh, oh, well, we'll look I at that. I am that guy. So, you know. I can't bend you over. I can't lift you up. You I got that right. You can't, can't bend me over. I can't. If you scoop forward, that... I had a dude try to do that to me. I was like, nah, bro. I'm not doing that. <laughs> nah. Put the pill. I was like, he scooted towards you? Because I was already giving him head, and he tried to do the scoot thing, and I, I was gonna like, lie. nah, bro. When the head gets so good, you be oh, she nasty than the motherfucker. Let me go ahead and scoot. <laughs> Let me go ahead and scoot. Because she nasty than the motherfucker. Let me go. So I scoot. Yeah, I'm scooping to it the head. I yeah. don't want just some head. No, no so I scoop. What? Yeah, cause oh, she baby. doesn't know what I do. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I so I scooped. A nigga get the booty walking. That means you doing a good ass job. <laughs> <laughs> booty walking. <laughs> Wait a minute, bitch. Wait a minute. You <laughs> invite the nigga to the party. Wait a minute. <laughs> you bring oh. a nigga in the Astro World. Wait a minute. Yo. Astro World. <laughs> he scooted towards you, Lulu. Damn. He did a little scoot, and I was like, nah, yo. I was like, I'm good, yo. I was like, pick your pants on, man. Scoot I I guess there's no other way to like start that conversation though. That nigga hit the tissy slide <laughs> on your ass, didn't he? <laughs> I'm gonna show you how to get it. They go right foot up, left foot hey, up. Hey fellas, you gotta be like, <laughs> I'm, I'm saying you gonna have to fucking slide. <laughs> Miss Lose Bay, um, <laughs> you partake in eating ass. <laughs> That's what they gotta ask a, a formal. <laughs> they gotta make a formal request. They gotta submit it in writing. They gotta. You gotta get a scroll or some shit. You know, like hear ye, hear ye. Like I need some, <laughs> like some prep, man. Every oh, time a girl's like, ever done that, you gotta fill out a B twenty two for that, and then file that with the cash. We gotta yeah, prep for that. We gotta. We gotta like both have talked about this shit, and it's an agreement. So if it happens, it's not like out of pocket. We wasn't like that for this you girl, to just get on my Michigan face State like that. Made me feel like a baby with a white nigga. That's how I think I felt like a goddamn baby. She took me home from beat up. She just still was beat up in one hand. That bitch knew I just had wings. That bitch took me home from oh, beat up. Beat up. That's the thing, bro. It can't be a conversation. It can't be a prerequisite. It's got to be. First of all, as the man, she just got to. If she's with that, then we both go find out in the moment. That's, I'm not asking for it. You're not asking me to do it. 
you got to be, and it's like, oh, 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 okay. But I'll tell you what, goddamn legs ain't going up and I ain't bending shit up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> See, That's I always fact. ask questions. I picture, because there's a I lot of her turning Clayton on there. his side. You did the side? No you turned him on the side? No, you didn't, Clayton. No, you didn't. listen to him. <laughs> You ain't no little nigga. So everybody like, wait a minute. So how did she get in there then? Like, what happened? Mermaid style the shit out of him. She... What? So did you like sit on her face? Like what? First happened? of all, listen, this this <laughs> has grown legs. This is gone quite enough. Why do you keep turning? <laughs> To here, man. Yo, I just say <laughs> after that girl, I respect the back Bay bend? area. Are you crazily. trying to do a back bend of, uh the, the bridge? Are you trying to do the bend? <laughs> you did a crab walk over her face and she was I'm like just to hear from the pull of damn <laughs> core and water from the fall on him in that goddamn chair. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> I can't be like the me, boy. <laughs> 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 he went to go put his shoes on. She was like, yep. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. You and now I need here. to know. Because you leave here untainted. Man. <laughs> it's only but a couple of ways y'all could get that done. So I don't see. You always <laughs> think about that girl, too. Like, no matter what you've ever been through, like, as a man or as women, whoever gave you that first crazy experience. You always wonder where they are in life. You like, Are you I on wonder. your back like a turtle? I wonder how she do it. Hey, can I tell you something? You I saw that bitch, hey, I saw that bitch <laughs> in, the, uh, in the Secretary of State years later. And I was like. <laughs> well, you get, ask you'll do anything chill. to get a bill passed. <laughs> <laughs> Secretary oh. of State in Detroit is like our DMV. Just yeah. so y'all got a heads up. <laughs> oh, oh man. Secretary of State, bro. Oh. I still need to know. I need answers. Let me tell you something. First of all, good, Lulu, have you ever hit the gooch? Yeah. You, when you okay, so you basically ate an ass there. And if you right there, you nah, literally nah, nah, nah. a million. I'm right there. There's there's nah. an extra step there. There's an nah, extra nigga. step. <laughs> there's an extra That's like, step. Hey, you ever been to Tennessee? Like, you basically been to Florida. Like, nigga, no, you haven't. <laughs> <laughs> I will <laughs> never. <laughs> In the words of my boy Stevie J, you gotta hit the Captain Morgan on the you gotta throw your leg on the uh, on, a, on a barrel and look into the distance. Words oh of gosh. Stevie J. Okay, I'll make sense. I can see that. That is see that. That's that's different. Uh, until your knees buckle. <laughs> And then something. you end up sitting on her face anyway. Exactly. 2009 was a wild time. But <laughs> yeah, right now, man, that girl. Uh, first time I did, it was just, it was like, it, like you say, it, it was in the moment. And it was like a, a sex drunk thing, a sex craze thing. Like, what else can I do? Mm. And that's how it happened for me the first time. It wasn't planned or anything. It was literally super organic. Like, uh, yeah, uh, sexual predator. predator. What else can I do? <laughs> <laughs> What else? <laughs> Put your dick on the PlayStation. <laughs> what? I can see P was like, what else can I do? Stand behind the curtains, let me see if I can see you. <laughs> this all began. You know, he, look at him. You know he gonna get mad. At, I don't know why you go after him. He about to go in on you for the next why? 20 minutes. I didn't do nothing to this me. man. I didn't do anything do to him. He, he came in swinging. I just said hello. He did not come in swinging. <laughs> First of all, to hear, I can see you right now coming to coming to the bed with, with your damn lingerie you've been showing us a couple weeks ago. <laughs> Talk about I'm, I was I went into the bathroom and slipped into a little something more comfortable. <laughs> that is where I keep the rope. A big ass onesie with the buttons on the back. <laughs> on the butt. On the on, on the ass. Uh, Four play for CP is is what his else can I do? Bizine and his eyes slow. <laughs> you say what now? Four play for you is your wife just dropping Visine in your eyes. It's real slow. This is. The joke is on you to hear. I use regular Visine. I just gotta squeeze it harder. <laughs> hey man. Oh <laughs> hey, my man. God. What happened? 
Y'all need a drip. I need a squirt. They get the same shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I need that shit to cry into my eye. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> tell me what happened. Ah! You know what I'm saying? Anyway, go ahead. Let's put it to a vote, man. Put it to a vote. I'm going to go with Chitlins because I've... I'm not doing ranch soda. That's yeah. just not, a, not an option for me. I don't okay. even drink soda. So I'll figure yeah, out chitlins. Drink. Can't you put hot sauce on them joints? That's Hell all people put in it. Anytime I see people eating chitlins, they drown it in hot sauce. It's like, you don't like chitlins. You just love hot sauce. Right. Because how can you taste it? All you taste in this hot sauce. Yeah, I'll take it. Is it kind of like greens? Like, oh, uh, like, uh, no. 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 Oh, damn. The I closest like thing you can get a chitlin like is collard go greens. Get Go get some, uh, what do you call it? Remember the chip pork rinds. Go get a pork rind. Oh, I love pork rinds. We call those okay. chicharrones. So put some water, dip it in some water, and then try to eat it. And that's a pork rind. I mean, that's a chitlin. That's the closest or, thing you would or, get. Or take some chicken wings and boil them and pull the skin off. That's better. That reminds you of chitlins, and I love boiled chicken. Boiled chicken was fire. Your grandma made it when you was little. That was, was a like, good broke this? snack. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Throw them bitches out some boiling water. Bam, salt, yeah. pepper. Mm -hmm. Oh man, what? Okay, what, I'm going with chitlins. What I'm you going with, uh, CP? Chitlins. Okay, the CT. I know you doing chitlins too. Of course. What are you doing? Because you're just asking us and moving on to the next thing. You still ain't answered the lights on or lights off. I know. You I said lights ice on. Cold, yeah. Right. You want an ice cold ranch? Mm -hmm. Yeah, bro. Yeah. Big gulp, my nigga. Big yeah. gulp. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the chitlin soup. I'm, yeah. I'm, I can't I can't do no ranch. You gonna do a gallon of chitlin? I don't even like the way ranch tastes on its own. What? I love now. That's what it's that's what we divided in the house. Cause I love. Let me tell you something. Uh, Wingstop got the best goddamn ranch in the game. You understand yeah, me? Yeah. Best it just, goddamn. It just tastes ranch. like it tastes like 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 they stir it and they pray to it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like they stir it their time. Amen. Hey, man, with this rent. Hey, with this hey, man, with this rent. And they take the spoon out, let it drip. Hey, <laughs> man, with this rent. <laughs> with this rent. Well, hey, he better hey, chill hey, before Rick this? Ross take that and put that in his new commercial. <laughs> <laughs> we doing thighs now. We doing thighs. Thighs now. Hey, man, to this ranch. Hey, to this ranch. Man. I love Rick Ross, man. That it's nigga a... make it look at, he make fat look fun. Like, damn, I wish I was fat a little bit. Just when I see Ross. I got a cow. I'd be like, man, that nigga fat than a motherfucker. <laughs> oh. Man, you going with Chillin' Sue? Yes. Okay. Chillin's <laughs> has it on that one. It's unanimous on that one. We're going to jump into this last topic right after this. This podcast is sponsored by BetterHelp. Look, life can be very overwhelming, and many people are burnt out without even knowing it. Symptoms can even include lack of motivation, feeling helpless or trapped, detached, fatigued, and more. Look, I've been burnt out plenty of times, working too hard, not feeling like I have time for myself, not feeling motivated to do anything. Sometimes we associate being burnt out with work, but that's not the only cause. Any of our roles in life can lead to us feeling burnt out, and BetterHelp Online Therapy wants to remind you to prioritize yourself. Talking with someone can help you figure out what's causing stress in your life. I've been in therapy for over three years and it's been one of the biggest helps of my life to just get my mind mentally back to where it should be and not feeling burnt out. And I wouldn't change it for the world. BetterHelp is customized online therapy that offers video, phone, and even live chat sessions with your therapist. So you don't have to see anyone on camera if you don't want to. It's much more affordable than in-person therapy, and you could be matched with a therapist in under 48 hours. Squadcast listeners get 10% off their first month at betterhelp.com slash squad. That's betterhelp.com slash squad, S-Q-U-A-D-D. -D. Last topic of the day, we have, would you rather deal with your partner arguing or your partner's silent treatment? Arguing, I can't, I can't deal with that, that silent shit, bro. My, listen, arguing, literally yeah. two days ago. You yeah. understand me? I got in trouble. Okay, <laughs> it happened. I got in trouble, and uh, whoo! When when your woman gives you the silent treatment, she can turn the house cold than a motherfucker, nigga. I was cold in rooms she don't even go in, nigga. I was like, God damn, some is the air on, nigga. 
I would rather her argue with me because a hot argument is better than a cold shoulder any day. Yeah. Okay. I mean, and then like nothing's getting resolved when you both just walk around quiet. You still gonna end up arguing. <laughs> the argument is coming. So we just get well it over with. Yes. Just get that shit over with. I like to just go ahead and get and like it all fight. out. So. I don't want this. the side of treatment just like you said, CT, it makes the house feel cold. Mm -hmm. It makes me angry because if you silent treatment me, you showing me what I could do without you. Like matter of fact, it Ooh. is you know what I'm saying? Like you, you, you are you gonna shut me out? Or, 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 are you gonna <laughs> shut me out? All right, bet, watch this. I bet I'm having fun down here by myself. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, I get I get on the PlayStation and loud as fuck on <laughs> online. No, I ain't doing shit. Let's run another one. I am, I'm petty. You give me the silent treatment. I'm going to dress up like a mom and I ain't going to talk to you for three days. I'm going to be in the house. <laughs> Damn. The whole time. Like, I'm going to be a mom for three days. White face, black outfit. That's the petty level I'm at. You give mm. me the silent treatment, I, I'm going to go into a coma. The bitch here, come to the hospital. I love about a silent treatment is that the complete opposite of what CP just said is showing you everything you need me for. Oh, it's pointing out everything you need me for. That's the only thing I'm getting out of that. Other than that, let's argue. Let's fight it out. Get it over. Well, let me start folding my own draw. You're going to be in trouble. <laughs> Yo, the greatest silent treater of all time is Tangerine Thomas. I promise you, <laughs> I need her for everything. And I remember that shit the moment she get mad at me. And I can't ask her shit because she mad. The moment your lady just starts saying shit like, Huh, good morning. You be like, fuck. I gotta get out of trouble, nigga. You already know. You find any reason when she's mad at me, I'll just go up like, hey, this bum got a head on it. I find any <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you know what you gotta do? Freeze right by him, probably. Shit. You know what you gotta do? <laughs> hey, she gets too mad at you. You gotta fall down the stairs. That's the only <laughs> way. <laughs> you gotta fall down the stairs. What happened? What was that? That's what, what, was that? what was that? I hurt myself. Are you serious? And I'm throwing up. I'm throwing up. Uh-uh. Oh, you ain't going to fall for that? I'm leaving then. <laughs> oh, you ain't going to fall for that? <laughs> and I'll be like, um, it's some crackers down there. Mm. <laughs> you a cold beer. I got a virus. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, I just gonna ask a whole relationship question, huh? Okay. Yeah. Right. Um, I don't know. Niggas uh, been giving me the silent treatment. Damn, so, Lulu. Um, oh mm. man. So game, baby girl. I don't know. So I guess uh, you better start reaching into that friend street? circle. But no, it applies to friendships and shit too. Cause I'd rather <clears throat> argue with my friend and especially a See, good I don't friend. really argue with my friends. But I'm just know. saying, I would rather be an argument yeah, a than just a cold cut off. <clears throat> I'm gonna be real. The last cold argument I had, the last argument I had with a friend ended a the friendship. I was like, oh, I ain't doing this. And it was like, it was after a couple months of building up of me being like, right, I'm gonna let this bitch pass. I'm gonna let this bitch slide. I'm gonna let her slide. And the last one, I was like, you know what? I'm cool. And she was like, 13 years. Bye. Can you take criticism? I think that's a bigger part of the question. Oh, yeah. Like that's my, that's, I think that's my biggest uh, my biggest attribute. I welcome criticism. I take it all in. I listen. I'm, I'm a great listener. So it's like. Can I tell you some advice? You start eating some ass. Because if you ain't having nobody to argue <laughs> with, and nobody <laughs> tired of treating you out, and that's the one thing you ain't doing. That's the one thing I'm not doing. See, that you're right. That is the one thing I am not doing. You, you may be the problem, Lulu. Six I months. Start eating that. Six Fuck months. That, you get invitation. Welcome to Lulu and Terry's wedding invitation. It is happening for me. <laughs> well, you know what? See, I'm going to take your advice. The next man that I get to actually date, I'm going to start eating his ass. Oh, these look, comments about to look, go crazy. You'll be all on Instagram <laughs> like, this man is surprising me with so many things. The <laughs> lobsters, the flowers. <laughs> <laughs> the you grenade bouquet. You know, no, <laughs> so I, don't, I don't even bouquet? ask him if... I don't ask him if he wants it, right? I just, I just go, just go full throttle. Just well, you see how he react. I mean, look. Y'all got the, the shower thing. together. Y'all got the pool together. You got to know the ass eatable time. You got to know hygiene. Like I don't. Here's the thing. I don't. <laughs> my lady doesn't do that shit. So I like to revisit 
past situations with chicks because those are the wild times. You understand? But uh, <laughs> for said, you, you said, yeah, yeah, ain't no asking going on in here. But I tell you nah. what, in my heyday, <laughs> <laughs> listen, Farron has tried almost kicked her jaw off. Don't play with what? me. What? You, I thought you would be the one that liked it. You wouldn't have been out here like that. Like, yeah, he like, you wouldn't have been out here like that. You like that. Drink this. Do drugs. Now turn around. <laughs> you talk about it. I know what she's trying to plan it, too, because she'll try to feed me smoothies the whole day before. Like, bitch, where's the food at? You trying to clean me up. <laughs> I just need you properly evacuated before right, I'm, 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 uncomfortable. I'm uncomfortable with this conversation. <laughs> I swear you was be the main one bending over to here. I thought no, you was going to be turtle, no, no, no. little turtle on your yeah. back, legs no, no. up. Fight me to the dead. Uh, so here, I got some little ass TV fuck around clenching bitches, and then they break. Oh, <laughs> <yeah. laughs> oh <Ow>, shit! <laughs> you can only eat boiled skittles from now on. <laughs> He'll be more relaxed if he just if he just let me do that. See, 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 see you've you been be acting funny since I called just... that nigga with a straw between his gap drinking his soda, and I was like, I ain't gonna tell nobody. But ever since that day, he's been on 10. And I was like, well, I learned it from you to here had two cups. He had some lemonade and he had some tea. He had them both in his side tube holes. Talk about maybe an honor Palmer real quick. I'm like, fam, just put him in one cup. I'm out. I'm out. Put him in Wait, one cup. You hear? I'm out. Let's go to the other chick place. Can I get a, uh, a, a, a sweet lemonade and a sweet tea, please? Today. No, just separately, please. Two straws. Thank you. <laughs> I hate this. I, I hate, you for, that, I hate <laughs> you for that. Thank you. I hate you for that. Thank you. Thank you. That'll be seventeen seventy three. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is that the here out there? You know it the, is, sugar. The two side team visit. Oh, took me out the game. Hey man, Yo, let's go wild. ahead. Let's put it to a vote. I'm ready to get the fuck. I don't have to. You do gotta get the shit. hat. They put the two cans here, and then hey, you Lulu, just put it into Lulu, the Lulu, team. Lulu, Lulu, shut your ass <laughs> up, okay? MVP. That's the game. Here come out a Palmer man. Here come out a Palmer man. Oh my god! Take a picture with the kids. Take a picture with the kids. Out of Palmer man. <laughs> on like, a Palmer man. <sighs> Lulu gonna have guns to this nigga here. Like, let me eat your ass. <laughs> let me eat your. <laughs> <laughs> Do it for your country. Hey, hey, hey. here she can be like, "What's the procedure when a lady got a gun to your head and a tongue to your head?" <laughs> Pop quiz, hot shot. Get <laughs> in the left drawer. Get the cash out of the left drawer. You know you don't fucked up, right? <laughs> Lulu was am I? Am I? My boyfriend's ass liquor. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> Message. <laughs> oh, man. All right. We're getting out of hand, man. This is squad right, ass, man. not squad put, ass. Put it to the vote, man. <laughs> <laughs> put it to a vote. What was the question? Cold. Uh, wait, arg- deal silent with your treatment? partner arguing or deal with your partner silent treatment? Yeah. Arguing. For arguing. Me. Arguing. Yeah. arguing. Arguing. Arguing has it on that one. It's unanimous on it. Listen, thank y'all so much for watching another ridiculous <laughs> episode ass. of Squadcast. Shout out to our special guests. We got CT. We got Hulu Gonzalez. We got Fan Moore. Shout out to Original Squad, Pat Meg. Uh, and C and CP at this point is he's, he's original. He's the original member, lady. It was unofficial, officially unofficial. But uh, Meg mm-hmm. will be back next week. Look forward to having her back in the oh, studio with us. Where oh, damn! So I'm gone. All right, cool. That's, nah, that's nah, cool. fuck that. You know, cool. your ass ain't gone. It was cool. Make it easier to book. Hey, this is my first squad cast. I'm so excited, dude, because I'll be like, I'll be seeing the clips. I'm like, I want to, I want to be in a squad cast. And then Pat was like. <laughs> You should have told me. I'm like, that's how this shit works. I had no idea. You sound like me last week. I was like, ooh, can I tell people? Yeah. <laughs> hey, let me tell you, uh, at watching shows that your friends are on and you ain't on, you always feel like you on punishment. You be like, nigga, I, I wanna, 
I want to play with my friends. Can I, can mm-hmm. I, can I go? Hey for me? <laughs> it, it's hey literally just guys. as easy hey. as hitting me up, pat up. Like, yo, can I get? Yeah, absolutely. That It makes it easier. Trying to book people. We be in a group chat trying to get the time together. Hey, who can do this time? Ah, I yeah. can't do it this time. Can we do this time? Ah, I got to call. I'm like, look, uh, mm-hmm. uh, He made but, it so yeah. easy. I was mad at myself. I was like, hey, Pat. I want to do squat. He's like, all right, cool. You want to do Monday? I said, son of a bitch. Close mouths don't get fed, CT. A- after you, after you had that conversation, when he texted me, it was like, hey, CT wants to do squat. Camp. All right, perfect. We're scheduled for Monday. Man. That's literally how it happened. He had to rearrange his meeting with uh, Starlight and Homelander. Uh, oh, come on, man. They've been getting into it, and they no. come into CT's <laughs> office. <laughs> Come on no in, close spoilers. my door, please. Come no on in, spoilers. close my door. Oh, shit. No, no, no. It's just, it's just, it's just. You know. <laughs> it was a call back to earlier when he said superheroes gotta come have a conversation. Oh, yeah. With me. yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. <sighs> just don't get like, no boys. How you doing? Boys. How you doing, Homelander? Come on in, close my door, please. Starlight's already here. <laughs> <laughs> so, do y'all want to talk first? Do y'all want to tell me something or what? Something y'all want to tell me? We gotta get ready to get up out of here, man. I appreciate y'all watching again. CP got to go to uh, Safe Light Repair to, to get his glasses replaced. And we'll talk to y'all next time. On Look at his face. This is the offended face, bro. Safe Light Repair. And here it does. Safe crime scene repair. investigation at McDonald's. Who bit this burger? Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> Did you throw uh, some sesame seeds in the air to see if the wind blows? Who <laughs> 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 the fuck you? Fries are cold. Uh, nigga. Lulu would put guns on niggas who don't salute her when she walk in the gym. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I know you saw me walk in, motherfucker. Hey, to hear put personal time off, re- request in for lunch. So, yeah, I'm gonna do a steak next Thursday. I'm gonna need about two hours off. <laughs> because uh, I like to do a steak, a smoothie, and Yo. some Brussels sprouts. And... <gasps> Nigga, you are hilarious. Oh I need God. a quick nap before I come back to the desk. So I'm putting in an hour now. Because <laughs> Farron do a steaks next Thursday. So yeah. Thanks. <sighs> do this. Don't oh. do this for the steaks. Yeah. So. <laughs> Nigga. Yeah. This was fun, man. Yeah. <laughs> so. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get an honor proper? Can I get a lemonade and an ice cream? <laughs> oh, I got my oh, own hat. It's okay. Two straws, please. Thank you. Thank you. I know what my own straws. I got crazy straws that's coming out of my hat. That's what I'm saying. You got the crazy straws from the hat. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Bye, <laughs> y'all. All right. Oh, oh, my life black is golden. I see you be this cool. You make me your honor proper. Nigga, my life black is golden. Nigga, my life black is golden. I hate that song. Hold on one second. Hey, Kev, what's going on? Living my life. <laughs> <laughs> Lulu got ammunition magazines on her end table where real magazines supposed to be. Uh, this they nigga uh, did not leave nibble marks in the Oreo. <laughs> who, who bit this Oreo and put it back? <laughs> <laughs> who was biting all the Oreos and nibbling on all the Oreo? Here's what's fucked up. Every time you hit him with a joke, this nigga hit Lulu. Lulu, right. <laughs> Lulu ain't better than nobody. Listen, you gotta know your battles, baby. Uh, <laughs> hey, it's too rapid fire with it. I gotta, who else laughing? Who else? <laughs> Lulu got a CCW for, uh, like, nigga, I'm talking to you. <laughs> I just, I just, <laughs> this nigga is a heavyweight. I'm gonna start through the class where I know I can thrive. I don't oh. gotta say shit because I know CP gonna handle that. It's uh. going it's a circle of life, man. It's a oh circle of life. Oh god. Right. I hit her and he came back at me on the motherfucker. <laughs> 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 I be catching my breath, CP. <laughs> oh, no, man. man. You asked for this. You hey, with you hear he used to play little league football, he's put a mouthpiece in his mouth and still could talk regular. <laughs> what? All right, y'all, this is the play. Listen, blue 42, we go into the left and we go do our best. On three. <laughs> they have you bite into planks of wood to make picket fences. <laughs> oh my, oh shit. Look at the face. <laughs> <laughs> the face. <laughs> Why your head go back so far like that? <laughs> I swear. Come on now, we gotta go.
That they was gonna a good start one. Looking I got some big ass teeth. All right, y'all. That's been another episode of Squad Cast. We out of here, man. <laughs> Pete. Motherfucker.